Hello, I'm Edward Johnson with Biotope One. I wanted to answer a question that was given to me about my plant growing methods using plastic deli tubs. Why do I do it? So the best and biggest answer is plants that need a lot of humidity is going to be self-contained and you don't have to worry so much about maintaining high humidity in a large area. Uh, humidity in these deli tubs is relatively high. You can see there's a lot of condensation on the sides. And this cryptocorn needs a lot of humidity, as do most aquarium plants and a lot of terrarium plants as well. You can get cups that have holes in the top or that do not. It's up to you and the requirements of each plant as to which one you decide to use. Some plants you can grow without a top at all. The second biggest reason that I grow plants in these tubs and jars is when I plant tissue culture them, I need them to be sterile. Oftentimes when I get these plants, they came from submersed conditions. There's a ton of bacteria in them and it's very difficult to sterilize them properly without killing them because of using too much bleach or whatever it is that I might be using to sterilize it. Once you put them in tissue culture, it has to be sterile, absolutely sterile or you get a lot of fungus and bacterial growth and it kills your explant and your time that you spent is wasted because you have a contaminated vessel. You can see there's a lot of bacteria contamination in this. This one was contaminated and I sat it aside until I get enough to clean them because you don't want to just open these up and dump them because of all the spores. You want to do it with bleach and make sure that you don't breathe the stuff in. Growing new growth in these, there's very little contaminants that can get in from the outside. And the new growth that does occur has relatively low amounts of bacteria and fungus on it. And it's much more likely that you get a clean explant and a successful tissue culture. It takes longer, but you have to do it. It's the best way to get especially hard to culture plants into tissue culture. Stem plants grow relatively quickly so in a matter of a few weeks you can culture a tub of them you can even plant these out you don't have to do this just to tissue culture them you can actually split this up into other uh, cups and propagate plants yourself if you don't have a lot of space and you really like a particular plant this is a great way to uh, grow more of them and you can trade them among your friends or whatever but this is a great way to grow plants if you have limited space I like to use deli tubs to put plants in. They're a little more expensive than the drink cups, but they're more durable and you can stack them. You can see that there's not a lot of water in them. Most plants you can get by with just keeping the soil wet. And you can see. But with the caps on and you don't see any condensation you probably need to check your water and add a little bit I always keep the lids snapped on pretty well this cryptocorn is doing doing pretty well it's getting new growth going and before long there'll be more plants in there if you have any questions about how to tissue culture or how or why I do things that you see you can email me or PM me on Facebook, and I'll answer them to the best of my ability. Thank you.